Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying two new to us drinks. Um, well, this one is definitely new. It is the uh, Mountain Dew Major Melon. It is dew charged with watermelon. I have Pib Extreme, and uh, we haven't had a Mr. Pib or a Pib in I think I've had one in years. Yeah, so. this one's a little bit different, so we'll yeah. get there in a minute. Uh, these were $1.88 at Walmart. They were in the front. This is just the regular calorie one. Uh, they also have a diet version, just in case you're wondering. I figured we would just buy the full calorie uh, one. Uh, do charge with watermelon. It is 270 calories for the bottle. Um, and uh, I guess it's just watermelon, so we're gonna find out here. Both of these have been in the refrigerator. We like our drinks cold. Yes, we like them cold. Well, this was actually in the front of Walmart. Well, both of them were. They were both in the cooler, in the cooler at the checkout. So that's where we found these. Definitely watermelon. Yes. I like that. I like it. It's a little like the rind, the white part a little bit. I was going to say, it does taste, it, when you first take a drink, it tastes like a pure watermelon candy. So like a Jolly Rancher. It really reminds me of a, a Jolly Rancher watermelon. But then once you swallow it, it has that little tiny bit of uh, bitter to it, just like the white part. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you do, and that's kind of the flavor you're left with. So you're not left with the really, really sweet. You're left with a little bit of that bitter. Yeah. It's good, though. I mean, if you like I think watermelon, it's good too. You try it out. Definitely. Yeah. I think it's good, too. And I can only imagine that the diet would be just as good. Yeah. Now, I don't know how long this is going to hang around because it is a little Um, I was told, specialized. a friend of mine told me that this is supposed to be um, a permanent addition. I can't imagine it. That, that I know. I, I, that's what I was told. So uh, I'm sure um, he. I just has can't imagine that being right. uh, as popular as some of the other flavors. I know there are other. That's a, very that's a very specific person that's going to like that. That's going to like watermelon and drink and it all the gonna, time. Yes, that's going to drink this. Well, he actually bought the regular and the diet, and unfortunately for him, he bought two 12 packs. And he didn't care for it at all. Yeah. He didn't care for either one of them. Yeah. He thought, I, his opinion was that it was light, that both of them were light on the watermelon flavor. So for him, yes, it's going to be a permanent addition, but not for not in right. his house. It's not one I would necessarily buy again, but no. I'm glad I tried it. Yeah, it's fun to try, yes, but I won't buy it again. Yeah, I'd yeah. rather have just a regular amount of dude. Yeah, <laughs> so if you try this, you'll have to let us know what you think of it. Yeah. Uh, this is the Pib Extra, and uh, it is spicy cherry soda. So uh, this is also full calorie, 230 calories. So this was 270. This is 230. These are always a treat for me when we do the... Uh, Cola reviews because I don't drink it anymore. So, oh, that's like a Dr. Pepper. That's what Mr. Pitt is. Yeah, that tastes like Dr. Pepper. It has a slight cherry flavor. Slight. Very, very, very slight. Slight. Well, kind of like a cherry Dr. Pepper has a very, very tiny slice. Right. A little bit of cherry. That has a touch of... I don't get the spice, but... No, no spice. No, but Dr. Pepper and Mr. Pibb are kind of the same. Okay, well... They've always been the same. Oh, okay. Well, the, there that, you go. That doesn't taste any different than a regular Mr. Pibb to me, except it might have a slight cherry, but I could be imagining the cherry no one has cherry in it. Yeah, no one it has cherry for me. I just thought Dr. Pepper, that's what came to my oh, yeah, mind. 100%. I didn't think of cherry or spice or anything no, like it, that. It tastes like a Dr. Pepper. Uh, it's good though. I do like, yeah, I like it. If you are, are already a fan of Dr. Pepper, you're going to like that. that yeah. That's good. I don't know about the extra part. I don't know that it's any extra. Um, I don't think it is, no. but it's just, it's just a good drink. Um, honestly, between the two, I would pick this one I would too. Um, <laughs> just because um, uh, watermelon is not a flavor that I'm going to want at every meal with everything. Right. Um, because usually when I pick a soft drink, some people pick a soft drink and they only drink it once a day or these special places. 
For me, when I was drinking uh, Coke Zero, I was drinking it for every meal, every single meal. So I would not choose watermelon for every single meal. And, it would, you know, be for me, I, I drink, I buy root beer. And I, that's when I just, when I, most of the time I get, I get like one a day, maybe two. And it's just whenever I feel like drinking one. You right. Know? So I just re go in the refrigerator and get one. So um, I don't drink them all the time either, but that watermelon, watermelon is not a flavor I would go towards. No, especially when you're having certain types of food. I just don't know that no. that's going to accompany it uh, very well. It's not bad. No, it's just it's a personal not bad. choice that, no. that we would make enough to buy it again. But try, try it out. It's definitely worth trying, especially if you like watermelon. If you like it's, watermelon, it's watermelon already, flavor. especially that Jolly Rancher watermelon, it does have that on your initial drink. Um, just know that there's just a little bit of that white part in yeah. there too. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.